Hey family, we have a special announcement for you with respect to the COVID-19 pandemic and the future of physical gatherings with Renovation Church. When this COVID-19 crisis first began to affect our country, we all found ourselves scrambling to innovate unique solutions to weather it well. There have been many wins along the way, uh, but now the question has moved beyond how can we continue in it to how can we possibly thrive? Surviving for a month or two is different from learning how to live under more enduring conditions. Hunkering down while danger passes overhead is different from building a home beneath it. Success will require special discernment of the Lord's will for us. Human wisdom, strength, and endurance will not be enough. Over these past months, we've experienced this beautiful thing though, the church reemerging in our own homes in new and unexpected ways. We are able to worship and even engage with one another through our phones, computers, and televisions on Sundays. All throughout the week, we are digging deeper into the unity we share in Christ through our small groups and morning prayer. We believe our next step is to organize a way to worship together in our homes that minimizes the virus's ability to spread. We call this Church at Home. This is the first phase of a multi-pronged path toward safely gathering physically again. Church at Home gatherings will be a group of people who gather around our digital worship experience on Sundays. This group or pod will be the community you worship with on Sundays as we seek to thrive through this pandemic. For some of you, this will be nothing new as you've been regularly gathering on Sundays with others in your homes and around our digital worship experience. We want to continue to resource you as well as give an opportunity for others to form their own Church at Home pod. Most likely you will have questions and we will do our very best to address those quickly and all the specifics will be coming to you this week. So if you have not signed up for our email communication and join our Facebook family group, listen, no one plans on living through a pandemic, but what we do know is that God's people can thrive under difficult circumstances. This is the story of the church and we believe that this is our next step in seeing us become who God is making us. I love you. I believe the Spirit is leading us in this endeavor, and we ask that you trust His leading as well. God bless you.